Hi, I'm Dr. Janet Six, Senior Product Manager at Tom Sawyer Software, and today we're taking a tour of the basic features in Perspectives Designer. Tom Sawyer Perspectives is a low-code graph visualization and analysis development platform. Integrated design and preview interfaces and extensive API libraries allow developers to quickly create custom applications that intuitively solve big data problems. This example application is for a microwave network. First, let's zoom into a part of the drawing view. And over here on the left side, we can see a tree view. And if we highlight one of these elements, we can see in the inspector view. Then we have tables. and our two chart views. Next, we will walk through the components for this example application in the Perspectives Designer. A project is organized into modules, and each module corresponds to a specific kind of data manipulated by your application. A module contains one schema describing the data, one or more related integrators, one or more drawing templates, one or more data views, and optional search, filter, and analysis configurations. Now we're going to take a look at the schema for this example project. A schema defines the structure of your data. We are in the schema editor, and you can see all of the schema information here in this tree. And you can also see it over here in the Visual Schema Editor, so you can work in the way that you prefer. Now that we've selected a node in the schema, let's show all of the attributes. Now we're going to look at the integrator. An integrator is used to bring data into the model. In this example project, we're using Excel to bring our data in. Now let's look at the definition. So we see the location of the Excel file here. Let's go ahead and test the data source. And that green check mark tells us that we were able to open that file successfully. Now let's go to the bindings where we will bring the data in from the Excel file into our in-memory graph model. So we press this little green icon. We're going to refresh the data from the data source. And you can see how we can bring it in and attach it to the elements that we previously saw in the schema editor. A domain defines a collection of model elements with filter style conditions. We are not using any specialized domains in this example. Next, we're going to go and look at the drawing template. And this is where we define how the nodes and edges will appear in the graph visualization. In this case, we're looking at the definition of how a node will appear. We define that each microwave antenna in our network should be represented with an antenna icon. We also define computed attributes, which will be used for tooltips and labels. And then we define which fonts and colors should be used. Next, in our project definition tree, we have graphs, which are definitions of input to graph analysis algorithms, and analyzers, which define settings for graph analysis algorithms. We are not using graph analysis in this example today. Next, we will look at our views. A view is used to visualize and interact with the data models in your application. First will be the drawing view where we'll have our graph visualization. Here's where we'll set the layout properties for our drawing view. And here is where we will bring the nodes and edges into the drawing so we see exactly the part of the data that we want to see. Next, let's look at our first table view. 
And in the definition, again, we define exactly which parts of the data that we want to show in this view. As we can see here in the project definition tree, we have two more table views, two tree views, an inspector, and two chart views. Next in the project definition tree, we see our filters and their definitions. A filter defines the part of a model considered by integrators and views. Then we can enable the search functionality in one or more views and let users search for model elements. And we can add tags to label model elements of special interest. In today's video, we discussed what the designer does and gave a tour of the functionality. And you too can see this microwave network example, which is shipped with Tom Sawyer Perspectives. Thanks for joining us. Contact Tom Sawyer Software today to start your free trial of Tom Sawyer Perspectives.